okay, you're gonna do a video on if there are different layers of punishment or different levels of punishment in hell. So this is a video I haven't really done on before, and it's gonna show some scriptures that give the indication, okay, not saying it's 100% fact, but it strongly gives the indication that there are different layers and levels of punishment in hell. Deuteronomy chapter 32, verses 22. For a, fire, for a fire is kindled in mine anger, and shall burn unto the lowest hell, and shall consume the earth with her increase, and set on fire the foundations of the mountains. Okay, now, foundation of the mountains, that obviously shows that hell is under the earth. But, notice that wording there, lowest hell. So, if it's lowest hell, that would mean there is hell that is not as low as that part of hell. Okay. Psalms 86 verse 13, the second time where this term lowest hell appears. Psalms 86 verse 13. For great is thy mercy toward me, thou and thou hast delivered my soul from the lowest hell. Now again, we get back to this point, that if it's called the lowest hell, that would mean there's obviously hell that is above, because you can't be the lowest if there's not something above you. You can't be in the lowest hell if there's not a hell above you, people in hell above you. Okay, just the English, common English wording right there, just that English language uh, wording right there. Proverbs chapter 9, verse 18. But he knoweth not that the dead are there, and her guests are in the depths of hell. That is depths plural. Okay, what does that show? It could mean that there's obviously layers and depths of hell you can be in a you know like the depths of the sea the depths of the water well the depths of hell you can be deeper and deeper into hell and obviously the context is obviously you know about the harlot woman and her, her guests are in the depths of hell so depths would indicate there's different layers and isaiah chapter 5 verse 14 why would hell have to be have, have different layers well here's the reason why isaiah chapter 5 verse 14 Therefore hell hath enlarged herself, and opened her mouth without measure, and their glory, and their multitude, and their pomp, and he that rejoiceth, rejoiceth shall, shall descend into it. Okay, why would hell have to have different layers? Number one, I believe to punish more wicked people in different layers of hell, but also because people are constantly going to hell. So they have to enlarge herself, hell has, hell has to enlarge herself to fit all those lost wicked people that go down there. So. And of course, the other part where the term appears is Isaiah chapter 14, verse 9, where again says the hell enlarged herself. Now, I'm not saying it's 100% fact, but what this strongly shows is that there is layers of hell. There's different layers and depths and, and levels that are down in hell. I believe that the more wicked you are in this life, if you're lost, the more the deeper of a layer of hell you're going to go into. That's just my theory. So just wanted to show you guys that. Are there different layers of hell? Possibly. So don't, so just wanted to show you guys that from the scriptures. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with all the brethren. Goodbye. Thank you.